Hey and welcome to my channel, Fun with Revit and Dynamo. Today we will look at a drop down menu for our welding plate. From the website we see several different types of welding plates with different thickness, width, length, bolt diameter, bolt length. We would like to create all of these as different types so we could choose from inside the Revit project as a drop down menu. We go back to Revit, we open up our uh, welding plate in the family editor. We go to family types and as you can see at the top we have type name. We go to create new. The name will be this one or we can go a little loop start at the top. We copy it paste it in okay and we duplicate the values you see here over to our welding plate plate length was 100 thickness was 8 width was also 100 bolt length was 60 bolt diameters 12 e1 was 20 and e2 was 70. We apply and we have now created our first type inside of the welding plate family. We do this with every plate that is shown on the website for the welding plate. We create a new one. We have now created all of the welding plates from a website. We load it into our project, overwrite existing version, and now we can choose which welding plate we would like to choose from the producer of the welding plate with our drop down menu. As you can see, our bolt looks a bit funny, so it's a bit off the bolt, so we might want to go into the bolt family, we edit the bolt family, we go to the front, and you see it's 30, we adjust our bolt head length to down to 10, we apply it, we load it into our welding plate family our right existing versions we load it into our main project and that looks like the welding plate from the producer we go back to our family and we also like to create one last one that i called custom <coughs> this one 